<laughs> okay, guys, my thoughts on the are the tournament. Um, I want to make sure you guys know this is just my opinion on the quote unquote changes uh, that we had. I'm not no fishing planet god or nothing. It's just my opinion on how they've changed. Um, so far, uh, what what I saw in the tournament was exactly the same as we've seen in years past. They said new mechanics are coming. I don't think they were in this one, obviously. This was the same as last year. Um, actually, last year, this we did really good in this Pike Tour. Uh, this year, the same thing happened. I did not very good compared to everybody else in the group, obviously, because um, I think me and Ian were the only ones that didn't make it in the group. Um, and a lot of friends made it this year. So that was awesome to see. And actually, Qualifier 1, I did the exact same thing basically as last year. We led, we were the top three the whole Qualifier. Um, and then kind of faded out. Also, 706 people, guys, uh, on PlayStation. That's crazy. Um I think that's the most that's ever been in a qual or in a tournament, at least in recent years, for sure. Um, and uh, PC also had like 500 and some, or close to 600. And then uh, Xbox, when you guys told me what it was, and I forgot, I can't remember, it was 400 or something like that. But anyway, for Fishing Planet to get 2,000 people on all platforms, that's got to be pretty cool for them. Um, and anyway, uh, guys, so, uh, but yeah, qualifier one, as you guys saw, we were first or second the whole time at the very end, I slipped to third and, um, we just fell back, didn't get much fish at the end. That's fine. You, you know, everybody has bad luck. So, um, but anyway, on that front, um, I also love seeing that 900 people watch qualifier one. That means we were able to help a lot of you guys. That's really cool. And I just want to say thanks for everybody that came. I think uh, I, I could look here quick too, but I'm pretty sure there was over 900 people that watched Qualifier 1. Um, here, let's take a really quick look. As I will look right now live to see what it has. Yeah, 974 people. So that's half of the people that did the tournament watch us. That's really cool. That's that's awesome. Our community's doing really well. But anyway, let's go to, we'll talk about Qualifier 2 a little bit here too. So Qualifier 1 was exactly the same. I used the same stuff I did last year. Um, did fine. I'm definitely not mad with 34th, especially with helping out people. You know, that's my goal. I don't miss, I don't care if I make the semifinals or finals. I did more last year. That's why I practiced more last year. And then over here, guys, this was... So last year is the year that I found um, the Eagle Spoon or the year before and found the spot that I did last year that obviously is what helped me blow or uh, people come to the channel on Qualifier 2. This was actually last year's deal when I showed you guys the Eagle Spoon in that one spot and you just stayed there. And it worked for Rex. Uh, Rex made it. Um, and and uh, the mechanics were exactly the same. And then also Shock made it. Uh, so And a bunch of other friends made it. Uh, but definitely the mechanics were exactly the same. Me and Rex did the exact same thing. He just had much better luck than I did. And that's really awesome to see. And then if we go... And, and same with Ian. Ian had uh, the same luck I did. Uh, not not ideal, but it was still a decent run. And then in Qualifier 3, I want to be very clear, this was exactly the same as Mechanics, but we learned something new right before we started streaming, and I talked about it in the stream. And you can definitely tell because people definitely had a little bit higher scores than they did last year. And as you can see, Pella is in first place. Now, it's not quite over yet. There's uh, It's less than an hour away, but... Pala, really nice job in there. And Peanut, really good job there in the eighth right now. You guys both are going to get through. That's awesome. Um, but that's incredible, Pala. So if, I know you watch these videos. So really good job. And uh, 
for us, for me, you guys can see the zero. I at the end was goofing around catching some stuff. Uh, qualifier three might have been the worst I've done in a year and a half. Um, and we did the same thing as we've always done, like we almost made it last year. And um, Pala had to do his after us, so he didn't do it with us in stream. Um, but I'm assuming he used the jerk bait just like we did, and he just had good luck. So, yeah, I mean, this was, you know, this, you know, Winter Pike is a tough one because it's luck based. You, everybody kind of knows the spots and, and that, but you definitely found out there was more trophies possible than what we originally thought. So, but the mechanics, again, were exactly the same guys. So, um, and we just, every year you learn something, so the scores go up a little bit. Um, as you can see, uh, we talked about it in the very beginning of the stream. There was more trophies than what people thought were available, and it wasn't a change from last year. It was just we knew more. So if you caught ones really far out in Qualifier 3, if you caught two out at, like, the 180 feet or well, what would that be, like 60 meters, then you could catch one or two more close in in that same half an hour before they respawn. So that's something um, obviously Pala did. Pala, I'm, I haven't talked to Pala today, um, but I'm assuming Pala probably had 12 trophies at least because uh, that'd be meeting at a 14 power average. And trophies generally are from 11 to 15. So he probably had even more than that, and he dumped his bag. I haven't talked to him today yet. But anyway, uh, that's just my thoughts on the tournament. So, guys, nothing – I didn't see nothing different, and it was a blast. I mean, actually, the worst I'd done ever in, in a long time, even when I, before I dumped my bag, I wasn't doing that good. I only would have ended up like 50th or 60th, and – um that qualifier three, that stream was the most fun I've ever had. And I don't know why it's not showing up on YouTube, uh, but qualifier three is not popping up on YouTube. I don't know why. Um, it still says it's processing. Sometimes that happens, so I don't know what that is. But anyway, um, awesome job, pal, Rex, Shock, everybody in the group that made it, and anybody else that made it, good luck, guys, in the semifinals. Uh, but... My thoughts on on the the, two, the tournaments, everything felt the same. Um, now they didn't say they were going to be in the the new mechanics were going to be in right away, um, but we'll see what happens then on that front. Also, Rex will be streaming the semifinals if you guys want to see what the semifinals are like, um, and all the group will be there obviously with them guys all making it. So, anyway, guys, have a good one. We'll see you later. Um, and good luck, guys.